Right, hello everyone, and welcome to the Go Nuts for Gaming audio podcast. What? Yeah. Not, what? not video. What? It's it's better. It's better than our video podcast because you don't have to look at us. Yeah. <laughs> and I got a lovely beard trim there. <laughs> and Jerry, you got your beard trim and your haircut. Lovely. lovely. It's gorgeous. Rubber uh, And we can talk and we can be more adult. Oh, yeah. adult. I yeah. love adult. Explicit. So, uh, joining me here, I am Ronan, by the way, from the Dungeon and Donuts store in Galway. Uh, hey. Mark is here. Hello. Jerry is here. What's up? The regulars from the video podcast. And uh, we have a way. new addition, Pete. Hello. All the Hello, way Pete. From York, AKA sorry. Paul. All the way from the H- Higginbottom. From AKA the lovely AKA land of Yorkshire. Dirk Dagger. Not quite, <laughs> but close. Dirk Dagger. So, he goes by a lot of aliases, does <laughs> Pete? Yes. The, the aim of our audio podcast is to talk about mostly Warhammer. Yay! Uh, mostly Age of Sigmar. Yay! But we'll, we'll talk about other things as with well. With a sprinkling sure, of right? other things. We can with talk about. Emorge! Pat Emorge! Warhammer Skirmish! Warhammer Quest! That's all Warhammer. That's all Warhammer, so Jerry. So really? Yeah. Yes. So, no, mostly, yeah. Uh, for people who haven't seen our Go Nuts for Gaming videos, I am Ronan. I have been playing Warhammer for about 18 years or so. Jesus. Uh, mm. I have most, because I think by the virtue I've worked for Games Workshop and I own the store, I have a lot of armies. Mark. You do. I am Mark. Hello, I Mark. have been playing Warhammer. You are welcome here. Oh, thank you, thank you. Namaste. Thank you, namaste. <laughs> I've been playing Warhammer since <laughs> 2006 maybe? 2006 I think. I think since we had, we had a, the Fun Forge. Yeah. Up in Ballyban. So, yeah, it was after I started I, I my job out of ju- college. So yeah. it was about 2006. It was a year before the shop. Pretty no, much. No, 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 no. It was a long time before the shop. Oh, well, I met you probably yeah. a couple of years before the shop. So, yeah, about that. I started with dwarves. So I started with the Battle for Skulls Pass. So that was dwarves and goblins. Mm-hmm. Or green skins, as they were called. You keep it brief, Mark. <laughs> It's not a it's a monologue then, now. Then then, <laughs> Welcome to Mark Brown, then, the life of. After six months, I moved on to. I think and yay and no. <laughs> hey, nani, nani. I am now playing death. D four. The gash for life. Mark is the dead. We. I am done. About two years ago, was it a year ago. Two years, years ago. ago. It was really myself, Mark, and Jerry. Um, kind of did a tale of four gamers where we had to order oh, was, chaos. Was Paul. That, um, Paul. Tall Paul. Trader Paul. Trader Paul. Trader. Um, he's left us. Trader. Had uh, destruction. I like him. He's a trader. <laughs> <laughs> and that's why you're here, Pete. Yeah, for like bands. Him. Oh, yeah. Just the balance Jerry. of the thoughts. Jerry. Yes. Introduce yourself. Oh, yeah. Hello. I'm Jerry. I've been playing Warhammer for about 25 years. My first army was Debt. And then I had a bit of a. <laughs> what happened army. to them? So your first army was Dead. Death. Oh, sorry. Death, the no. old undead, Death. back okay. in the day. And then I had a bit of a chaos one, and at the moment I'm playing Corn and Skaven, and I'm starting to do the Zinch Army. Mm. But we'll get to that we'll later. We'll talk about more about that yeah. later. Pete. Um, my name is uh, Paul, uh, a.k.a. Pete. Pete. Uh, <laughs> I've AKA been playing uh, Warhammer uh, since Last I could uh, saddle a Whippet. Um, Last weekend? <laughs> uh, which, is, which was very early in my uh, life and career on oh. Earth. Um, last weekend. Yeah, last weekend actually. Yeah, it's brand new to me. Um, I'm, I'm currently trying to make the high elves work <laughs> in Age of Sigma, which is uh, not easy um, because they they die it's pretty nice. easy. But um, I'm uh, I'm playing this. I'm going to play Stormcast, uh, I'm, and I'm also going to move on to the Ideneth, yeah. uh, you know, which I'm, I'm actually wasn't entirely taken with to begin. Uh, you know, fishes on land wasn't really my semen. bag. It's, uh, that's you're, like, you're yes. all about the semen, people. I was all insert about the there. insert, yeah, insert joke. Uh, but now I'm, uh, I'm thinking. It's a joke. Uh, it's serious. It does like it semen. I'm thinking that uh, you, you know, know semen. giant giant turtles yeah. on land are there in my bag now. So there you go. That, I think I'm going to call my uh, Iden King Master Bates. That's just that's just ridiculous, isn't it? Mm. Why would you do that? Because it's a good name. It's not really. He's going to bait people up in combat. Question before we get on to any of this. Right? Yeah. It just popped into my head when he said turtles on land. Turtles on land. Are like little Turtle baby turtles that you can buy in a pet shop. Yes. Roughly the same scale as. <laughs> yeah, why not? <laughs> that Moon. would be class. 
Go! Get go a blow charge. I've got to be honest get with you, a, t- a, a turn will be a long time trying to get that <laughs> over the table. How learn. far does it move? You know, feet. just glue them on. You would well, have to glue them. Sanitate them on. Do you know what you'd have to have? Do you know those sticks that they have on the air when they're moving aircraft across? You'd have to have one of those moving your turtle. Or you could magnetize them. As we don't have Magnet. like a name for our audio podcast, and we probably come up with a name at, at, during every episode, kind of like another program. That could be a good name: Blowtorch and Turtles, Episode One. Blowtorch Blow and Turtles. turtles. Yeah. I like it. Okay, cool. So that's uh, us. No audience. turtles were harmed in the making of this episode, <laughs> except for that one. That's us. Yeah, Between us, we have. He was a tortoise. They don't count. Sixty odd years of gaming experience. Jesus Christ. More than an old person. That's pretty good. We're all old beardy gamers. <laughs> Apart from I'm clean shaven. Apart from American clean shaven. <laughs> uh, so, Weird today, Age of Sigmar 2.0 came out over the last kind of month and a half. Yes. Indeed. Is it better than the first one? Why is it better than the first one? Mark? It's better than the first one. I suppose it is. It has gotten more complicated. I don't like the complications that it's brought in. What complications, Mark? Magic and, and stuff. Magic and stuff. I don't like complicated games. How Age dare of they bring? Was very simple. How dare they bring magic into a fantasy and game? Now it's just not as simple as it was. But did the I, other change about magic is that, that you can dispel it from further away. Did, did, I, did I miss all? And you have malign sorceries. Complications. I just I'm not. Death. Jerry, is Age of Sigmar two point oh better than Age of Sigmar one? It is better. I think it is because they've tidied up a few things. They've the whole. You can only if you're in combat, you can only shoot the unit you're in combat with. Makes a lot of sense. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, yeah I like it. It's Dave. That changed out. The yeah. points are a wee bit more a yeah. tweaked a bit as well. But it, and the thing I love most, Pete was just flicking it. You can't see obviously because we're not on camera. Maps. The, the maps. Roland maps. Maps. I know. We now have a world is. that we can yeah. look at and go, yes. ooh, there yeah. is a world. Yeah. Now. When the old world got buggered over. Blown to pieces. <laughs> when Age of Sigmar first came out. Too yeah. soon. There was a lot of rage. A lot of rage. I hate that. Where are they going? They killed a really good story, and now they have an amazing lore. The lore is and maps. Yeah, yeah. Well, actually, maps. this is the bit that I was going to yeah. move on to because. Pete, yeah. um, is Age of Sigmar you, 2 better than Age of Sigmar? It is, but uh, for very different reasons for me because I know that you lot are going to give a highly technical beard view of, no. of Age of Sigma. You clearly don't know me. <laughs> a- apart from beard. Mark, who's yeah. got no beard, but I'm going to give it a, a slightly different slam from my point of view because I'm, I'm a fluff monkey and really love. Really? Really I'm love. Fluff. Whippets, monkeys. How much do you charge? It's like that. It's like, <laughs> it's like a I'm monkey boy. From my point of view. Nick getting the boys here from the vermin vaults. The fact that they released this. Ish, the fact that they released. Shash! I will have my say, or you will die. Quite you. Um, I didn't interrupt you. Don't interrupt me. That's yeah, that's that's no, right. No, yes, no, yes, no. Yes, no. Let me have a say. Don't make us bring in a talking stick, Jerry. Uh, I, um, from my point of view, the first Age of Sigma, um, I was gutted over the fact that Warhammer had died, and I was completely devastated. And the elves and all the. I put I, up my hand to agree. I cried and cried heavily. Mm. And uh, th- were you, know, you one of the people who burnt things? No, but the guy who did set fire to stuff online, choices. I was I was right there with him as uh, solidarity for the all brother. All they do was kill Carol Franz and the story would have progressed nicely but but, but yeah, nobody likes I resisted playing Age of Sigma I really did I came into the shop I wouldn't play it I wouldn't do it and eventually I did but <laughs> We it didn't down. have it didn't have the background like, for like me like a lump of marble being carved into Michelangelo's Davis it didn't have the background for me it was a bit light That's on, on background it was, it was very gamey but now this second edition the book is beautiful yeah it's got lore it's got background mm. to it and now it, it makes the, it's made the miniatures the actual game come to life for me so whilst the technical side of it I don't mind I just love playing mm. and I do like the new rules um, well, we it, played a massive game the other night I love yeah. yeah. In fairness, Age of Sigmar two is three years on from Age of Sigmar. So in three, three years. Yeah. Yeah. In three years they That's have built this amazing world with loads of lore and fluff for all you fluffy people. Yeah. Uh, fluff monkeys, yeah. For me Why did they I guess one though? I, I'm I'm probably the most gamey gamer of the four of us. Yes, you are. Uh I, I like the game. I, I also like the fluff, but I'm much I'm I much prefer the game and, I'm and trying 50. to build the best armies etc etc but can we talk miniatures just for a second no. because 
Do you know? Is this just, a miniature showpiece? No, no. Just just for a second, I was I hated the idea that you know like you know high elves disappeared off the shelves and mm. there was just some stuff. Bretonians like, have and, been killed. Co- Bretonians were killed. Oh, and I really man. hated Never this, heard. and I couldn't see a way. Never that, heard. I couldn't see the way you know, like the Stormcast would. We were okay, Sigma Marines and stuff like that. And I, but eventually. I came around to the idea now that actually they're replacing them with some really mm. cool armies yeah. and they're very different. They're not samey, so they're sorry, really Sorry, no, sorry to interject there now. Oh, no. Sorry. Here he goes. Here he goes. <laughs> no, but sorry they haven't gone. They're still there. They're in like... No, no. They are still there, but they're mean? not... Re- but if you look now... What arm? I mean, if you look now at the new armies, yeah, yeah you yeah. can play the older stuff if yeah, you want to. That's the great. The last winner of the last Grand South Coast GT was mixed order. Yeah, well, that was the, like, the Grand Tournament last year. It was mixed order. Yeah, using which is all about the like older stuff. And stuff. But what I'm pointing out is that if you look now at the new armies that are coming along, all those people that kind of like me who lamented the death of like you know saying oh I can't go online and buy silver helms anymore or oh, boo hoo, uh-huh. I look at the stuff now and it's just so radically different, but yeah, it's yeah. just so interesting. Yeah, to see, get that, into that's the thing why would you want to yeah when you because have... Bretonians were class yeah Bretonians <laughs> were class right? I don't know Bretonians they, were they, were they weren't two dimensional at all Bretonians <laughs> are a figment of Mark Brown's imagination they'll bring out something new in the next couple of this is months the twilight zone that all these guys riding cool mad horses and that'll make up for everything with lots of flowing stuff better. behind them Roland's just trying to make Mark feel better that's never gonna happen <laughs> but you see the problem I had with it oh here right? we go oh yeah, yeah. he's off in one now it's purely financial oh. I had spent a lot of money <laughs> investing in yeah. the Bretonian yeah, yeah, and they have now enough. wiped it out completely so yeah. I may as well be like the guy on the internet that burnt all these models yeah but you're not because I can't play them well you're not that kind of Egypt you're in Egypt but you're not that kind of Egypt <laughs> But you could just spray them all white and wash them and they'd all be undead because they're all dead. I want them to be Bretonians, not undead. I have an undead army that is undead. Mm. I don't need a Bretonian army to be also undead. That is a good point, Mark. They are one... I can't just, think of any other Tomb King fight, armies. It's, it's the only, Tomb Kings are still there. It's the they're only army that has been completely not in Matchplay anymore. They're in the Legends thing along with a lot of the Dark Elf stuff. They are in Matchplay. They have scrolls. No, they've been moved into that Legends thing. You know the Warhammer community side? Yeah, the Legions and the Gash book essentially wiped out the Grand Alliance of Death. Yeah. So if it's not in the Legions and the Gash... But if you're making a match play army can you with still Death, have? you can still have the... Oh, really? The Tomb King stuff. Mm-hmm. They're just called other things. Alright. Anyway. You see, Bretonians aren't in the GHB anymore, so they don't have a... Point. I'll have my quick say on oh, the GHB. Oh, GHB. Yes, you made MFI. CID. Well done, Mark. No acronyms on this show. Oh, sorry. Let's do a few. So as a gamey Sorry. gamer, <laughs> Age of Sigmar 2 is much, much better for yes. the reasons that the lads pointed out already. No shooting in combat and all that kind of crap. And the command phase is a lot better with the new command points and the three generic command abilities you can use uh, in the battle shot phase and the charge phase, etc. Mm-hmm. And getting to use all your command abilities of all your heroes that you bring. Yeah. It just brings a new dimension to army building and combos and how combos will work and interact with other units etc etc so and of course the malign sorcery yes which is huge the endless ah, spells really. the endless spells are going to be I don't know whether I have been rather will they be fact huge for they have been they already have been. there was a there big one the umbral for... spell portal is now oh that's right one and, the, and the geminids and the geminids as well I don't know I, well, I didn't hear yeah, about the geminids so the geminids was... can't affect the same unit alright the spell portals have been completely That's right. I remember rolled that. back. Have they? Yeah. You can now only cast either one endless spell through the return or one spell through All the right. return. Cool. And like Age of Sigmar 2.0 or whatever you want to call it is, is generally better for all them reasons. And as Pete was saying, a beautiful the box, models yeah. that came out. The models like, have gotten better. Are stunning. Uh, and well, like, it is. It's a beautiful box set. It, my <laughs> problem was never with the game, Age of Sigmar. Like from... The first time we, me and you played it, I thought it was a class game. Yeah. Is it the so round bases? No. Uh, everything <laughs> looks better on the round everything bases. Everything looks but better on the round But it's just, like, they only tweaked a few little things. And what annoyed me about Age of Sigmar, and I didn't really vocalise it at the time, were the stupid rules. Like, uh, like John kneel down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, Don't do this say stupid anything thing. about... For the lady! For the lady! Yeah, I mean, come on. As a gamey gamer, I hated that shit. Yeah, bro. Well, it's a bit of crack. But it then they, they, they got a bunch of guys <laughs> together and created the General's Handbook, which was huge. It changed everything, I think. Yeah. Yeah, it did. So Pierre played all them playtesters well, the and gamers. Like, we met yeah. some of them. It was a hobby until they brought out the General's Handbook. Yeah. It's, still, it's still a hobby, man. Well, no, yeah, but yeah. it was more for the hobbyists. Now yeah. it's for 
the gamer as well as, as someone well. said when I used to work for GW maybe you've heard this as well because I used Pete. to work for GW as well yeah. uh, and GW Mark make didn't. the best models around it Did just you? so happens there is a game you can play with them yeah now, oh, obviously, dude. most of the sales games are shall get are probably due to the game. But that, but that motto did change oh, yeah. quite yeah, often. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, you know, but yeah, it was. We made the best, you know. But a lot of people come into the store and just buy yeah. the models for the models, you know? Anyway, we move along. Move along. Because we could spend hours on the, to the weather. Two, two weeks ago. To the weather. Out in Mark's house and garden. Out in, in the, the rain. rain. Crawwell, in, in, the in the summer rain. rain. In, yeah. the, in the rain. We played a big, huge Warhammer bash. We did. There was six of us. There was. We all had two and a half thousand points each. We did. Even Pete. Even, even Pete. Even Pete. You built, built I, like a... I built a, like a maniac uh, two and a half did. thousand yeah. points of, the correct way to that of elves uh, so and went absolutely <laughs> cross-eyed. Yeah. For the people who weren't here, <laughs> Sean, uh, one of our uh, customers and friends, had... Is it me? Stormcast? That's a strong word. Oh, yeah, he had, yeah. yes, he he strong strong That's a strong word. Uh, Paul, show you uh, he wasn't here. Uh, had death combined pirate. hybrid death dwarf. Well, he, he had <laughs> dwarf pyres. Dwarf yeah. pyres. Yeah. Yeah. But Paul yeah. is probably the least experienced Age of Sigmar fan. He just got models because he liked models. Oh, he just came out for the crack, didn't yeah. he? Yeah, he the crack. Good. And it was good. It was kind of. It, it wasn't. Roll the dice all it wasn't really a match play thing. It was an open. No, play. no, it was a complete. It was more beer and pretzels in the game yeah, happening yeah. at the same time, kind of uh, thing. I had chaos. You did. With Archeon leading Saves of Darkness and. Uh, <laughs> And Archeon's beat. broken. Archeon is broken. <laughs> yes, Rob, we can still, agree. Still broken, <laughs> Mark, you had? I had my Nagash model. So, um, back way back when we started that Tale of Four Gamers, we mm. also had a Facebook page kind of yeah. doing our progress. And you were so afraid to paint Nagash. I was terrified yeah. to paint Nagash for about two years. Yeah. But I finally got around you and did. I painted him, and he is beautiful. He and did I a love very him. brilliant job, He is beautiful. I, yeah. I really, really like them. So I brought mine a gash with all my skeletons. Yeah. And now they've just brought it. It was a long window. labor of love. It was. It was like my I still, I'm still not finished. I'm still. You're actually waiting <laughs> for a day and a half. Well, a week, Mark. Oh, sorry. Yeah. How many? Yeah, but how long were you painting? Anyway, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I was painting constantly. So painting. just when I got the gash finished, I was like, <coughs> oh, I'm finally getting to the end of my death army. They bring out Night Haunt, and now I've kind of fallen in love with those as well. So I'm now painting an entire Night Haunt. And Jerry room. tried to make up for his faux pas at the trip to Nottingham by bringing... My boy Nicket. Yeah. yeah. I don't boy think, I don't think it made up to him. But still hasn't been to the home, Nottingham. The home he will. He will. We'll be over there. He yeah. could have. He could have been there last time, but you didn't bring him. Yeah. No, I'm not going to bring him. Not bring him. But Nick, yeah. it, Nick is sell out, and some of me old skating stuff, and some of me new bloodbound stuff. Mm. Yeah. Oh yeah, you have Nick's case. And Pete, I had. Who did I have on the big dragon? Eltharian. Eltharian was it? Yeah. Yeah. Some, some, some high elf dude. dude. Yeah. On a dragon, which wasn't that big when you consider the dragon on the table was probably <laughs> snack size compared to <laughs> compared to uh, every all the archeon uh, and uh, everyone Sean else. Connery in the Untouchables said, "Yeah, you brought Q impression. <laughs> you brought that knife to a gunfight. I did indeed yeah. bring a knife to a gunfight. Uh, survived mostly. Just about. Um, just about. He had a proper go. Did he die? Um, no, everybody had a no, proper go. The lad died because he, he foolishly charged Nick. The Griffin. The Griffin, yeah. Prince. The guy on the yeah. The yeah, prince. It was like the bi- it? it was like the island of blood box set though. It was like Nick versus the lad the Griffin. Yeah, true. And he was, and broke he, his face. He did. An Archeon and broke everybody's uh, face. Staring at each other from a long distance. Away. Yeah, <laughs> I was immediately tenderly across the ladder for yours. <laughs> Archeon tenderly caressed Why everybody with a huge paw. Zombie birds. It was hilarious. Yeah, uh, I ran away. And from you had, what else? You had a big unit of sword masters. Oh man, I had like tw- I had 20 sword masters, um, 20, um, tw- a unit of 10 reavers. The, remember, reavers can shoot three times. Reavers t- are very good. Reavers, reavers shoot cool. three very times. They were, they, they, were, they were awesome. Um, but then what happened to Pete? The, they, they shot the hell out of stuff. And then and, what happened? And then I think somebody killed them. This gave them. Killed them. Yeah, well. And 20 yeah. sword masters to bounce off. And right what now. happened the flank that was faced up against the the It was, no, it just... Oh, yeah, they got butchered as well. Sorry to correct you now, Ronan. It wasn't just 20 sword masters. There was 20 white lines in there as well. There t- yeah, but they went after Archeon and got absolutely... Yeah, smart. actually, the, the tactic that I did... I, I was there, basically, for the crack. So what I did was I attacked Archeon. Let me interrupt Archeon. you just for one second, Pete. Just, just to mention we had a special mission. 
Oh yes. yeah. Oh yeah. So I was going to say this is this in is in the middle of the table. We were playing eight by four table. Eight by four. Yeah. Mm. In the middle of the table with six of us on it with two and a half thousand points <laughs> was one little round gate, and the idea of the game was to get all our units to the round gate, and, and our general, general, but our general couldn't leave. Too. General had to be last off the yeah. field. And I was bang in front of the round gate, so yeah. everybody. So horsed in at me. Whoa, so, whoa. No, Just, no, sorry no, to no, interrupt. No. Sorry to interrupt. Apart from the fact that I did tempt so, fate by shooting bolts at N- uh, Nagash, I yeah. warned and attacking before the game even started. Don't shoot. At, don't attack attacking, me, Pete. Yeah. So what and I did then was when you stuff, attack I, I me, thought died. for the crack, I'm going to shoot at um, Nagash, and I attacked Archeon with twenty sword masters mm. and twenty white lions. At the start of that game, we drew lots to see the player order, and I was last. And it was kind of annoying that I had to sit there <laughs> to watch two six hours. people or five people play. But as it turned out, going last was kind of sweet. Yeah. Because I got to choose who to yeah. whack. Yeah. And I had to put other chaos people in line that time. Well, it was the only thing I could Oi. charge. And Archeon, Archeon had to put do Put a bit something. of schmuck on them. Put a bit out, of schmuck on them. Out of everything on the table, the high elves were Schmuck's somewhat outgunned. Yeah. But they Very still survived fairly pieces. well. And Paul Shulgin nearly won the game by not even rolling a bloody dice. He didn't even touch a dice. He was just slowly in the corner. We made him roll the dice for something. Uh, I think it was to I decide was something. Priority for turn. I, I think it was to decide the end. It was an end of spell, wasn't it? You had to roll oh, something. Oh, that's right. He decided an end of spell. That's what he did. There was also random endless spells appearing. And the first one that appeared, Jerry, uh, dispelled. dispelled <laughs> was Color <laughs> Corn from which, outside. Boom. Mark threw a hissy fit. I did not. <laughs> Poor old Max. I wanted to have fun with all the really end of spells, but We were no. having fun. You went off and ruined it. <laughs> ruined it for everyone, Jerry. We were yeah. having fun. It was going um, to appear right in the middle of your Razanax and Ashen Jaws and just go chompy chomp. But it was great crack. It, it was. was. And it just. Um, oh, what's the word I'm trying to look for? It just kind of. It's over how great this game is for, having you know, getting crack. together with your mates and just and having a crack. Started at nine, finished <laughs> at half. Don't be mean. Oh, yes, they yeah, started at nine, oh, nine, nine p.m. Nine p.m. Finished at half four. Hot four thirty a.m. So it was great crack. Yeah, and who won? And high elves. Jerry, we <laughs> all won because we all had fun. Mm, yes. That's right. We're but all. I won the most because I won. From from building that, <laughs> <laughs> I won the most. I won the mostest. Yeah. From building those best, armies, best sports and uh, playing that again. game, even though it wasn't a, a proper match play uh, game. Oh. Did you discover anything cool about your armies that you didn't know before, or yeah. was there a unit you brought that? I am going to get chaos trait tattooed I mean, on my left arm, so I remember to use my chaos trait that I, I still have yet to use three and a half years into the game. I forgot to use it all game actually. Yeah, <laughs> I need some graveguard. <laughs> Some necromancers and a couple of vampire lords, and I could be pumping out like two hundred and forty attacks. Mm. I need some bigger beasties. You do. <laughs> you know, um, well, and I don't know. Bit. I've won a couple of games, and I don't have any big beasties at mm-hmm. all. And I think Sean needs to learn that charging, retreating, charging Archeon retreat. with yeah, oh, a yeah. couple but of small Sean's elite units. Sean's first turn one. was to edge everything. Well, Moonwalk to the He back. was being cautious, tactical. No, Age of Sigma the is mission not. was get off the table. Age you tried to get yeah. off the table. Backwards. Age of Sigma is not for the cautious. Don't edge off the table or put your troops in a line <laughs> and slowly march them in a different direction. Attack, kill, go mad. Mm. <laughs> I've learned that Archeon's command ability is broken. Broken. <laughs> it's all broken. Archeon, it's just <laughs> broken, really. Kept killing everything. That's all people kept saying is Archeon was broken. I Meanwhile, Nagash is over in the corner. Nagash got a fair lot of wounds took off him by the yeah. aisles, it has to be said. Anyway, it was a great night and we're going to You're do it welcome. again. You're welcome. Fingers crossed. Back. Well, we have a different plan for the next one. We do. Which uh, segues nicely. In the meantime, so after nice. playing our big game, yes. and after opening our box sets, mm. and after seeing what's what, and after me being sick of playing with Stormcast and Order, but I'm going to play, time. we're going to play a patch of campaign. Oh, more. A patch of glory order. campaign. Mm. Yeah. I'm sick of order, but uh, I'm going to play the new glory. order that's better than the other order. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Jerry. <laughs> You're uh, welcome, Ron. Fuck you. Well, <gasps> it's okay. We can just mark it as explicit. Yeah, Curse away. Right. Yeah. Well, Fluff, I said you fuck. Flopping grass holes. <laughs> Anywho. With all the new players with Age of Sigma no, 2. No one wants to be the first one to curse. I know. I will. Oh, sorry. With sorry, all the new sorry. players with Age of Sigma 2, and there has been a few. A good look. Yeah. Uh, we're going to start the Patch of Glory campaign. <gasps> no, no, Tell no, us more. Them. It's only for the four of us. Tell me more. So for people who aren't aware <laughs> of the Patch of Glory campaign works, you pick a leader and the leader will get X amount of followers. Yep. Can I be the leader? 
No. no. Yes, no. Oh, of course okay. he's coming. No he shall not follow you, Peasy. No one wants to follow you, Peasy. Oh, okay. Peasy, oh. Polly, Polly, Peasy. Oh, 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 we're not going to be behind him, then in front of him. Easy. Easy. Careful now, careful. Easy, sorry. So, throughout these audio podcasts, we'll keep you up to date with our Patagory campaign. Oh yeah. Yes, indeed. Um, Which is how we built the first army. Exactly. Yeah, it's how we built. It's how I built up my strong cast army and my order army. Is this not how it just became a big arms race to find the biggest characters in the um, well, in the age it of could Sigma? Turn into and an arms race. It does yeah. eventually. But yeah. Not but it's kind of well. Uh, apart from what I found out today about James, who's not here, his army. Uh, it seems kind of balanced-ish. <laughs> <laughs> Do we'll, tell more. Tell more. We'll, say no, we'll, when we get to James's, we'll, we'll just... <coughs> that's all. <coughs> Did you realise that James is bringing horrors that turn into... No, I realised that, that James's horrors. leader is a Lord of Change. Yeah. Whereas my leader is the Guardian of Souls with a Nightmare oh, Lantern. Exactly. Oh. Hey, listen. Look, um, that, lan- that lantern <coughs> could be pretty dangerous. A yeah. Lord of Change. Fire. Not that yeah, what's he going to change? Don't forget, Mark, 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 Mark. We are playing on 4 by 4 to begin with. Yeah. So you'll be right up on his grill straight away. Running the smash yeah. his face. And that Lord of Change isn't that good in combat. No. But still. Probably better than everything else, though, that we're starting yeah. with. <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah. you know. Probably maybe. is we'll see. leading the arms race Would at the moment. Would he be better than Skyfires? Uh, well, he's good at spells. He's got a wizardry. Yes, yeah, so your skyfires are a small unit, so mm. you, they might not be there by the time it comes to you getting to move them. Ah, yeah, but I will have other stuff. You'll have many small units. I will have many small units yeah. anyway, and other things. So, are we going to go through the armies? So, well, I am. Um, because I'm sick of Stormcast at my order army, I am picking order, order against uh, <laughs> Idenus. No! This precise. is the army I was going to do! Yeah, well, James copied me, so you can yeah. copy him. All ah, right, okay. I, 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 I built my Matalan electrical wizard. Matalan? Yeah, yeah. You went to Matalan yeah, for yeah. some Idenath. That's yeah. the wrong What's place that? altogether. That's such a weird name. It sounds like some kind of Matalan old name old for God. Elves. He was the God sea god, the elven sea god. Oh, there you go, okay. Not an electrical demon. Oh, is that Matalan? No. Yeah, I'm sure it was the cheap clothes. No, no, no. The no, old empire god Manon was Matalan in the elf. I thought it was the elven sea god. Okay. That's what you said. Oh, did you? Right. It's just proves no one listens to me. <laughs> what, Jerry? Well, we'll what did Jerry say? Yeah. What did Jerry... Yeah. We'll, we'll cut that out, Jerry. We'll just have you sorry, sounding all quiet. Jerry speaking? I don't, I don't, who's Jerry? <laughs> who's Jerry? Yeah. What? Who is Jerry? Yeah. Shy, I don't know. Jerry who? Jerry who? That could be the name of the first episode. Is he the next doctor, is he? I who's Jerry? Burn and tortoises. Bold. Who? What? Anyway, I'm playing with Idenet. I'm taking a king, which is the lad on the seahorsey fella. Yes. A deep mare. Deep mare. Mm-hmm. And three units of uh, nemanatory trolls. Yeah. It would be really nice. Uh, <coughs> which are kind of cool. And I get me boat. A what? You did. Shipwreck. You didn't see it. He did, but he, I've seen it. Um, when's that? When is, is that out soon? Is it? Uh, which? The, the, the shipwreck? The boat's been out for Has it been out for ages, has it? Sure, yeah. I built it yesterday, Pete. You were watching me. Oh, I thought you got that as a. I thought you got that as a. No, no, that's been out since the Why haven't I got one of these? Go on. Never ordered them. Right, order me one, Jerry, quick. Yeah. Sounds. Remember we played the game of how much they are last night. We did play the game of how much we Go are. On, and, man. How much? Um, twenty-four. Quid. No, thirty-five. You get sixty. I said sixty. You're way off. Mad, yeah. mad man. What else? Anyway, I, I'm playing. I don't know. Lightning Codex. I, I'm playing Lightning with then Got it. the king and the three followers of trolls. Mark. I am, as I've said already, playing the guardian. Of souls with the nightmare lantern. He gets four followers, so I'm bringing three units mm. of ten chain rats hordes and one unit of mire morn Is that the one that gets the bonus followers? In the no, he's no, the okay. soul of the spirit torment. The now, that's what I'm bringing with the minute, but I might. Oh. I might oh. take one of the units of chain rasps out and replace it with something else. No bikes, no. But I don't know yet. <laughs> no bikes, <laughs> so No, it's, if I bring, start. it's just, it's just, it's we just numbers, started, yeah. you see. If I bring two, I can have two units of 30. But if I bring three, I can only have three units of 20. So we're kind of house mm-hmm. ruling. Because I've got 60. You can only have 10. Yeah, but if I roll these in subsequent rounds, I can add 10 to no, that unit. Yeah, yes, you, you can. can. You can. Since when? Because it's, it's, it's in the book. Forever, Jerry. <laughs> when it's uh, written in the book, you know that it's real. We're doing a little house through where we pick... We pick our leader, obviously. Pick the first round. But the first round, we will pick our followers from the basic follower table. Yeah, the written yeah. followers table. Then after table. that, we roll. After that, yeah. So no extra heroes from the start. No. No. Jerry. I'm going Zinch Arcanite. Mm. <coughs> I just like to add my Zinch stuff before James did. It was my idea before James did. 
Uh, so, <laughs> at the moment, in I'm, the podcast where he can't defend himself. <laughs> good. At the moment, I'm leaning towards having a Zangor Shaman on a disc. Yeah. And then he gets five Just followers. Two are going to be Skyfires. One. We had a very bad experience in Nottingham. Oh hence my hence God. the reason I'm bringing Skyfires. You didn't play that early, did you? <laughs> no. That's why you we, finished the ball. We dodged that ball. They got the easy route. Yeah. Yeah. The unit of the Enlightened, and then two units of normal Zangor. But that's mm. all because for when we have the army built, there's a battalion you can take. That is the shaman and three units of That's either enlightened or zang or mm. sky. But you're planning for your big army. Yeah, yeah, because I have I have it all there. It's just a matter of getting a paint on. But I have. I've started putting paint on the zango lads. Cool. <coughs> Pete, are you going to join us in our path to glory campaign? Of course. You I, think think you you should. I think you, you should. should. I think you should. Pete, I should. Yeah. I should yeah. do it. Yeah. Don't let you can ask me now what I'm going to do. What are you going to do, Pete, Sean? What are you going to do? Pete. Do you know what I'm going to do? Um, oh, I think because I've been uh, looking at the Ideneth, I'm going to do an, I'm going to do the Ideneth. That's okay. great. And idea. I'm going to have a uh, big turtle. Yeah. Yeah. We'll be able to have a big turtle from the start. Though. No, no. But I'm going to get a big turtle. Yeah. 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 Uh, and I'm just going to put some Ideneth lads together because unlike you lot, I mean, the, the guys at the end of this podcast are going to be looking going, that guy has no clue. I'm just in it for the crack. So I'm going to put together an Ideneth army. I think you'll find I'm also in it for the crack. Oh, right. So there's two people in it for the crack. We're all in it for the crack. Because no, you, right, okay, you can't all be in it for the crack. There can only be some of us. Some of us are going to be serious <laughs> now. I'm all deadly right? serious. Right, okay. So I, me and Mark are in it for the crack. You can be in it for whatever okay, you want. Okay. So I don't know if I'd say, yeah. I don't know as well. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Twice. Ow. Uh, oh, that's not your other people twice. who aren't here. Yeah, but that's a different one. So Jamesy is being Zinch as well. Right, yeah. Zinch. And John Cross is Zinch with the Lord of Change. John Cross is a new player. He's yeah. going to be playing Stormcast. Who's Stormcast? Who's Stormcast? You may know John Cross. Oh, John Cross. Yeah. I think Paul said he might join. Paul Troy, yeah. Did he? Sean yeah. is And Sean, well. I hope. Yeah. Stormcast. Sean Probably Stormcast. Stormcast. Probably Stormcast. Or Raven Guard. Yeah. Oh, Paul. <laughs> Did Paul say what he's going to do? Raven Guard. Raven Guard, yeah, that's it. Yeah. I don't know. Paul has to finish out Sean, his own Sean, I don't think motorbikes existed in. Oh, Rhino. Sigmar has been up to some mad crap. Yeah, what's yeah, what's sorry, Sean going to do with no rhinos for his Raven Guard? Yeah, yeah when Sean, Sean, when Sean asks when the drop pod phase is, you just know, I know, no, no, no. Sorry, Sean. Sean alone. No. His Land Raiders only come with reverse gear. Anyway, that's just, just like his Arcanaut. <laughs> come on, he's uh, not here for uh, Raven. Good. Poor Sean. Uh, poor I think Paul will probably finish out his Undead Army. Because he has the. Do you yeah. on yeah. Paul. Paul. Oh, Paul Choyo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, I can't remember. Is there Patrick Lowry tables for the other armies in the old general handbook? There's some in the Patrick Lowry Like book, or Dwarves or Jordan or whatever they're called now. Yeah, oh, they, Dispossessed. Be, yeah, yeah, yeah. They've been the Glory something like that. I think they might be. I can run in and grab the book and see. I'm really positive they're in the Glory yeah. supplement. Okay. Ah. And that's been FAQ'd, I think. Yeah. Good. FAQ'd. FAQ'd. Who else? The... Are we missing anyone else that might be in the campaign with us? Nope. Oh, but it's, like, awesome. it's more than last time. I think Sigmar himself it's is going to It's open for quite... members. Of anyway. course, yeah. If, well, like, if anybody is... listen to this. That's four think, of us. Yeah, so it's two boys. People. So the, it's twice as many, because there's only four of us doing it last time. There was. There's eight now. Yeah, and Jesus. There's... Who's the eight? The four of us. That's John right. Koss. Yeah. Uh, Sean. Yeah. Jamesy. And Shoya. Oh yeah, okay. That'd wow. be good. <coughs> double, double, double the excitement. Double yeah, trouble. and I heard that uh, Sigwin himself is going to join in. Uh, I'm weird enough. Just, that's, I don't want to spoil anything, but I've just heard that. That's Spoiler. Oh, there's no Spoiler. destruction, but there's two. There's loads of order. Yeah. Do you all know how to win at this campaign, guys? Uh, yes. Kill yes. all the other. Uh, kill all the other guys. Ten on the opposite glory side of the fun. Or <laughs> no, after you kill get ten opponent. glory points, you have to. Yeah, there's another. Have a battle. Though. Is there five yeah. new followers? Sabotage. Yeah, five new follower units. You can oh. also try and win. It's new. Five oh, yeah. new followers. Yeah. 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 So we maybe yeah, should after, not after have after five rounds. Real quick. Yeah. Uh, um, maybe not. Well, it might be over awesome. after five rounds. But I won't be trying to win after five rounds because I'll be saving up three rounds for a black coach. <laughs> <laughs> I could just win at the start because I'll have five units of followers. Five yes. new units, five, you five idiots. Five new oh. units. Oh. Oh God! And the Jerry's enemy? woken up. Jerry's back. <laughs> Five additional sets of followers and you're back after in the room. your starting set of followers. So All someone right. can win it in, after six games. Ah, Jesus! Yeah, sure look at, isn't that it? But like, why would you want to win it after six? When you I have the crack. crack. I, I want to win it after. I want to win it after. Thought six you were in it for the crack. Oh no, I'm in it for the crack, but I'm also in it for the win. I no, never, you can't. One or the other. Win. One or the other. Me. Sure, we know that. My opponents. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I do really. 
<laughs> cool, so that's our Path to Glory campaign. Yay! Excellent. Yeah. Uh, Before that, Kiska said, what's next? What? What's next? It's the table of contents. Well, it's the knitting section. Uh, Voulez-vous crochet avec moi? That's Jerry, right. Jerry touched on a, a little bit oh. in the Patrick Curry campaign where he's using that to make his big match play army yeah. or whatever. I'm doing the same with the hope to get in a turtle, just like Pete. I'm just going to buy a turtle. And some sharks. Um, but yeah, I, think, just like, sharks. I think we all are. I'm Mark, also doing the same. Yeah. Yeah. The I'm just looking chance. through the battalions here of what I can have. Yeah. Uh, Sean, I presume, already has all well, of the Sean cast paints already. already. Yeah, yeah. And the Raven God. And the Raven <laughs> Sean is the ultimate of speed painters. He is. Oh, he um, is crazy. Mind you, I'm... He'll finish a model one of these days. So... so <laughs> Lady Oliander. The new release is for Age of Sigmar. Oh. All oh, of... Oh, man, a constant stream. Like, this release for Age of Sigmar, and this block release for this product, has really? seen a lot of easy-to-build sets. Yes. Which Good. is a new thing. Game Good. Workshop. They've always had easy build sets, yeah. but a lot of the bigger things more there this time. are easy to build. Essentially all of, everything like, that was in Soul Wars is easy yeah. to build, plus a couple of extra. There's a lot of cool the big stuff. big characters, like yeah. the really big ones. But yeah. the quali- and the quality is amazing. Now, the yeah. one thing I have about easy to build oh. is oh. all converting. models are, yeah, converting or... It is, yeah, yeah. You can still do it, them as well. like... Because I did a fair bit of it with the, yeah, the Blood Warriors, um, and it was like extent. for like if you even just yeah, swap really out a weapon or a head, right. that so can make a huge thing. difference. Well, you can still make changes. <coughs> yeah, you can, but I'm saying the, the posing of all the models. But you can still make changes to poses. Yeah, that's if you're. Yeah, well, you can switch out a head <laughs> or a weapon, and you can <laughs> make the model your main moan really is that you're not good enough to yeah. do the posing on the. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you yes. can make it look completely. I I truly believe that the new the the for me right okay I know that we everybody knows that I have an issue with building stuff because I can't I don't have that much time these days. And loads, the fight that I built two and a half special, thousand exactly. points loads of time, out. Loads of money. I mean we all remember the five wood elves, don't we? Yeah, yeah this that, came to the shop with day. the intention to build. Thought I'd do some wood. <laughs> I've got a box of wood elves here. I'm going to add them into some silver. And I built five in about two and a half hours. And yeah, but that's you know, never mm-hmm. stop talking. It was more than ever. ever. Was it that more than that? Ever. 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 So it's to me... It's one of me and Mark's paint nights where we just... Yeah. Beautiful models that are um, easy to build, class. Yeah, we don't talk. Bring it on. We always I, have to crack them. I, can, I can't paint by myself. But then I'll invite Roger over to the house to go paint and then and then just talk get drunk. for each other. <laughs> but the point is, if I, ever go if I ever go paint with him... E- ah, okay. It's just to hear his breath oh, in the oh, room. Yeah. Oh. Hey, stop it. There is a potential that my wife <laughs> might listen to <laughs> I doubt it, Mike. I really I read. <laughs> yeah, just um, in case. It's all lies. It's all lies. <laughs> but the new easy to build stuff. Great. Regardless of Mark's... Reservations. Uh, reservation. And it is a good point. Yeah. yeah. Uh, our... Amazing. Oh, they are. Fantastic. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. The way, like, the grift, the, the Lord of Canaan on the grift charger in the box, the way that fits together is just so amazing. It's mad. It is. It, like, I didn't glue any of mine. Really? I just... I, because of my OCD, easy I, to I, build, I glued them anyway. Yeah. Yeah. I was going to say, I stapled them. I stapled them. <laughs> 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 <Staple, laughs> <Staple, laughs> so I got Rhoda, my welder out. Rhoda making the international <laughs> sign for the stapler. Um... <laughs> um but since that, they have the Ballista, the Secadors, the... Yeah, the... The Myrmore and Banshees. Yeah, the Cadors. Yeah. What, what are the two Cadors? dudes on the... There's, two undead dudes on the whole series? Dread, Dread Blade Arrows? And, uh, yes, the ones. Dog thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What are they called? Griffhounds? Uh, Castigators. Dracolines. Dracolines. Uh, but yeah. Castigators are easy A lot of easy builds. Chain it just rasp. makes me think... Are is this the future? Yeah, yeah. Is this the future of Muslim? Um, Jesus, I know it strays away a bit from the part, but I wish they'd make Necromunda easy to build. It could, <laughs> it could be, but remember, they're appealing to a completely, they're, compi- they're appealing yeah, yeah. to everybody on this it's, run, it's, which is it's not daunting for new players. But yeah. if you're an experienced, ga- if you're an experienced player, an experienced gamer, those models are still awesome. Yeah, you know. So there um, you go. That yeah. is my two penny worth. So what's coming out this weekend? Two this we are. Tell this us. is the recording. We are at the twenty. 20- 7th of July 2018 so Kill Team uh, we're not talking about that's okay. no, that, the oh, right. next new release for Age of Sigmar oh that's next again yeah is the, the boy on the tour line yeah Kill Teams 
No, 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 it's not them, no. Do you know Becky is in a war? <laughs> Lip Balm. <laughs> it's Western Dean. <laughs> the guy on the big tour line, the Lord of Canaan on the big tour line. <gasps> what? I'll have what is a one of those. Line? It's like a Pegasus. Tora, Lora, Lora. Yeah. It's, it's a big box set. It's 90, 90 euro. Whoa. How, that, like? how yeah. big is it? For it's, you people at home, know. you can't see, but yeah. big. it's that big. Wow. wow. I don't think it's as big as a Star Trek. It's not. I'm going to stay on dead. Uh, the Black Coach. The Black oh, Coach. Oh, yeah. The Black Coach. I heard that was cancelled. The Black Coach model is <laughs> bigger. <laughs> it's a great model. It's bigger Absolutely than the Grand Prix. Just in your mark. Yeah. The one I missed getting was Lady Oliander. We'll get sure, I should get have ordered her, but she's out of stock now. I'll get her That's eventually. Don't worry. I I can't use day. her in the past glory anyway. I'll order her later on. I've got one. I've got one. I don't even play that army, but I've got one. <laughs> I just threw it out. Did you remember that one? Yeah. You just threw in the bin. I yeah. opened it and crushed it. Yeah. Yeah. I opened um, it, linked it, and it down, probably yep. good. I think the black, of all the new death kind of hero level models, the black coach, the black coach is the only one that I can use in past probably anyway. But it's an amazing model, I yeah. have to say. I was looking at it the other yeah. night and it's 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 unbelievably good. Yeah. Uh, what an, yeah. It's really well posed. The stuff around it, oh, even I would consider mm. getting one of those. You probably should. Mm-hmm. I'll already on a Monday. Okay. Mm-hmm. But it makes me wonder, like, the Black Coach seems like a bigger model than the Lord of Canaam on a tour line. It's on a... It's on I a don't drag and it's base, cheaper. Isn't it? It's on a Star Trek base, isn't it? It is on a big oval base. It's one, I can't but the tour line just doesn't look as big. The Lord of Canaam on a tour so line. So it just makes me wonder, are you paying for power again? Oh, look at them there. Of course, course you are. are. So that's... Mm-hmm. Well, this is the GW's we could, one, isn't it? Yeah, it could be paying for power. Um, it's the only way to explain why my blood knights are the price they are. The only way to know, uh, I suppose, is by getting it in and we can have a look, yeah. have a Maybe look the and tell everybody. Maybe the tour line is a, a lot bigger than what it's, not, what it's going to be, but build it's more expensive. Build one up and tell oh, everybody one, about yeah. how big it is. Yeah. I'll, in comparison I'll, I'll to I'll build it and convert it with a seal's head on it so I can put it in my <laughs> eye. I don't like the color of the horse. <laughs> Just chop a seal's head off, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. we're another. No, no seals will be heard in the gaming community. Is that the new name of the episode? Club and Seals? So hey! <laughs> stop it! Oh, Club no. and Seals, you! They're like seals in the nightclub. <coughs> oh, yeah. Maybe. That's right, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Best look club in one of them. So that's all the Sigma releases that's coming out next weekend, I think. What about Kill Teams? No, stop it! <laughs> Bold Matt! Stop it! Stop, stop it! So, Bold Matt. I think that's pretty much it uh, for our first episode. Uh, over the next couple of episodes, we'll keep you in touch with uh, how our Path to Glory campaign is going. Very nice. Yeah, yeah very nice. Because very nice. we, we aim to ho- hopefully have these painted. <laughs> That's why I got my tin of white spray. Yeah, yeah. I, know. I was going to suggest that oh, we're all live. Oh, 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 here we go. Go on, then. When you're, you're, what's wrong with you, man? <laughs> when you're rolling on your new follower table, if your army is fully painted, you could... Adjust the dice roll. No. 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 Why that is, Rob? Why? No. Because you get to sit all day and paint things. <laughs> That's yeah. why. No, you paint like a demon. <sighs> I've There's actually a demon on the box of the paints. Who's painting? Yeah, you're not a golden demon. Oh, okay. You just paint. I have actually quick. started painting all my. my yeah. Well, no. I would say no. Just no. no. It's an it's an interesting theory, yeah, yeah, but, but no, just, okay. your dice won't betray you anyway. You'll just call out a number. You'll roll. It'll be that number. This is true. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Hmm. Dice are possessed. Okay. Well, that, that, I think that's it. Yep. Anything to add, chaps? Uh, well, I, I've, I've, I've brought a kind of speech with me if I can go through. It's about four. It's about the size of the Age of Sigma book, uh, core rule book. So. I Where just, is it? Show us. I'm just going to start. Oh, on your page. speech. I'm just going to start on page one. Yeah. Oh, is this the audio book? This is the audio. Oh, this is the Soul Wars. The audio. Soul book. Wars. The audio book, <laughs> as read <laughs> in Yorkshire. Right. <laughs> he, he, was Sigma. he mounted his whip it. <laughs> And charge ah. towards the night horn. Nagash was right proper bad. <laughs> Nagash was right mad about Sigma, it. why are they up in the sky? Why don't they come down here? How very day you profile me on my nation Poor of piece. Yorkshire. Poor cool. piece. Okay. Okay. Poor Yorkshire piece. I think that's it for this episode. Uh, ah, I've been Ronan. Mark is Mark. I've been me. 
Jerry is Jerry. Actually, I'd be somebody well, else because I'm being Pete. Yeah. <laughs> and we will uh, explain in the next I one why I'm called Pete. Why are you called Pete? I, because, well, let's just explain it now. But just before we end, I came into the shop, <laughs> spoke to Ronan, and Ronan called me Pete. And I ain't got the heart to say to him, my name's Paul. So we carried on for a little while, and I did say to him eventually, my name's actually Paul. And he went, right, Pete. And that was the yeah. end, and that was that. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. it's carried from there. It's like a turn. It's like a turn of endearment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think it's funny that you do respond to Pete. Yeah, I do too. It's really weird. I feel like you know people shout <laughs> it in the so street, so light around, and it's not oh, even buddy. me. So uh, that's our episode one. Yeah, the Last Forgiven Audio Podcast. Uh, episode one. Uh, so Turtles. One. Episode one. Apparently series so. One. Yeah. Uh, Tune in next time. What's our schedule for this? Maybe every we don't have two weeks. We're going to wing it. Every two weeks or something No, like we that. don't wing it. Oh, sorry. We're not... No. Listeners, we're <laughs> supposed to find if you've been right, listening okay. for the last 46 minutes, you probably realise that we do wing it. <laughs> but we must... Even though there's stuff written down. No, no, there's a, there's a clipboard with yeah. things on it. Let's say two weeks. Two weeks. Oh, that didn't that hurt. hurt. That sorry. didn't hurt any sorry, of the sound listeners. Person. Right, the sound person is gripping their head <laughs> and rolling around on the Uh-oh. floor. Don't Thanks for that. The sound person is everybody else. Oh God! To what's that, that noise? Maud can edit that bit. AK fire. Yeah, okay. Um, so that's it. Let's say two weeks. Two yeah. weeks. Every two weeks or so. Two weeks. Every two weeks. Every two weeks. Not or so. Every two weeks or so. Give it a second. This might be recorded in Ireland, but it won't necessarily just be listened to in Ireland. True that. We need time to. So, every two weeks. Um, or so. <laughs> Roughly. <laughs> Thanks for listening. Thanks Roughly for fortnightly. And we'll see you in about 14 days. <laughs> yes. <laughs> two weeks. <laughs> see you Go later, folks. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>